How's it going, guys? This is Isolate here, and um, I bring you week eight of the ISC. And uh, yeah, we are against Noah. He just made the YouTube channel, so go check him out in the description. I mean, he won't be in the description, but the link to his channel will be in the description. So click on that and then go to his channel. And uh, yeah, sub to him if you want. So um, yeah, he's bringing a Mega Gardevoir and Electros, E Electros, a Dodrio, which is interesting, you literally never see that thing, Meowstic, Milotic, and Embor. So, I knew he's going to bring Embor and Mega Gardevoir. Um, if I hadn't picked up Skarmory and Probopass in Free Agency, Mega Gardevoir would just destroy me, destroy my whole team, but luckily I did pick up those two. And then Embor just, like, destroys my team, like, my only switch in is Latias. So, and that thing's not even physically defensive, it's max HP and max special attack modest with Roost, Defog, Psy Shock and Shadow Ball. I guess I'll go through the rest of the team since I didn't really, um, since I don't really make team builders anymore, which I kind of want to get back to, but I'm not sure. Anyway, we brought, we're bringing the Kingler this time, uh, with the, uh, what do you have? <clears throat> you have the Agility, it has Agility, Swords Dance, Crab Hammer, and Knock Off. Um, I wanted to try to set up on something like Meowstic, even if it T-Waves me, um, three Agilities, or, yeah, three Agilities gets me to max, um, gets me to max speed and then like even with the thunder wave I can I'm at plus two because if I'm at plus six um, thunder wave decreases it by four so it would be plus two so um, and then possibly my load can be set up fodder not sure if it is if it isn't oh well but I don't know I wanted to try it out see how it works um, and yeah we're speed creeping a because he could have brought um, Excadrill so we were speed keep creeping a jolly choice scarf X Excadrill um, with our Kingler, because after plus two, we can outspeed it by one point, a Scarf Jolly x -Gale. so, yeah, and then the rest is just dumped into, um, defense, or max attack, adamant, and then defense, so, I believe, maybe it was HP, I'm not sure, anyway, next up we have Custat Berry, Sturdy Probopass with, uh, Thunder Wave, Pain Split, okay, Thunder Wave, Pain Split, Iron Head, and Volt Switch, so that's nice. If I can get the sturdy and then cuss that berry makes me go first to pain split, that'll be nice. If I can, I'm not sure. Then we have the life orb, um, thunderous, just like mixed with knockoff, uh, volt switch. No, not volt switch. Knockoff, thunderbolt, sludge wave, and something else that I forget. And then <clears throat> we have actually leftovers, Miss Magius with, um, nasty pot, shadow ball, energy ball, and something. I forget what it was. I think it's Mystical Fire. And then we just have a, a special defensive hazard stacking uh, Skarmory. So let's leave out. Let's just get right into this. Um, I let off with Thunderous Incarnate because I felt like if he let off with the Meowstic, I could knock off and get rid of the Light Clay. So that would kind of be great. But he's just kind of straight up lead off with the Embor. And yeah, I'm just going to go into my one switch in, which is um, Apollo. I, I feel like I didn't prepare enough for this thing. Um, so yeah, he's gonna, oh, by the way, before we get too deep into the battle, I have not lost a game on the channel since December 9th of last year. So, you know, not really pressure, but I kind of want to keep that streak going. If we can't, oh well, but yeah, that's, I, I kind of had, you know, a reason to try to win this. So, anyway, he's gonna switch out. Not that I don't have a reason to switch, to win every week, but anyway, um, I'm just gonna roost on the switch, because... Just in case he went for Sucker Punch, I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't sure if he was Choice Scarfed or not at that point. He's gonna, I'm going to go for Shy Shock. It's a 2 KO, but he crits me with Knock Off, which is a shame. I had Rosalie Berry on that thing, because Rosalie Berry uh, decreases his Fairy-type attacks. Uh, you know that you have the, a bunch of Berry, like a bunch of um, weak, like attack weakening, super effective. You, you, yeah, so I wanted to hit, take a hit from Godvar if I could, and then fire back with the Shadow Ball. Uh, Crabby Hammer, you'd say crit for crit, but that crit really didn't matter, seeing how much the Psy Shock did, so... Yeah, it sucks because Latias was kind of a switch into Embor every time, but... Yeah, not anymore. <laughs> yeah, so... Uh, yeah, so... The Garvor came out, I really want... I really thought he was gonna predict the switch in, like, HP Fire or something, because this thing is such a stop to... to Mega Garvor, but... I just, uh, I brought it in anyway, and he goes for Hyper Voice. I expected an HP Fire this turn, but he's just gonna switch into Embor here, 
as you're gonna see and I just go for the toxic only switching I press it as stealth box looking at it now but now but um yeah I didn't so whatever as this turn okay I made a mistake again uh, I'm, I don't yeah I made a misplay here I should have sacked off Miss Magius but because I thought Miss Magius was useful but to be honest it's not that strong um, especially if it's timid which it was I was trying to speed creep Gardevoir and I, you know, I, I've, I have answers for Gardevoir, I have an answer in Skarmory for Gardevoir, I have, you know, things. I just wanted to try to set up with it, I guess. Um, so I just let Skarmory go down. I, to be, you know, I, I had Probe Pass there as well. That's probably why I, I just wanted to sack it off. That's part of the reason, probably, why I wanted to just sack off the, um, the Skarmory. Because I had Probe Pass as well. That's kind of, it, it kind of hopefully walls Gardevoir too, but I'm gonna go right into City here, I'm just gonna Crab Hammer, he's gonna bring in the Milotic Alex, and um, Crab Hammer is going to do a decent chunk, I know I can p potentially set up on this thing, uh, seeing how much that, that, that did, it's definitely not physically defensive, so I'm gonna Swords Dance here, and he's gonna recover, this turn, it's actually pretty good for me, oh, oh, crap, I, <laughs> oh my goodness, I just, I just replayed it, alright, let's, let's continue, Okay, why are you... There you go. Alright, so I'm just gonna... I, I misclicked, guys. I clicked reset. Whoops. Okay, so he's gonna go into my Lodic, and I'm gonna Sword Dance if he recovers. Alright, so this is great for me, because this turn, I'm going to Crab Hammer. I didn't want to set up too much in case he got a Scald Burn, but you're gonna see here, like, he goes for Dragon Tail, so if I had Sword Dance again, I would've gotten no damage off, off on this thing. He's also a Life Orb, which is interesting, as he's gonna bring me into Bitopsy. I, I should have switched here. I honestly should have. I thought he was going to Dragon Tail again. But I wanted, you know, to Volt Switch here. Um, Purple Pass gets a kill. Uh, but, yeah. Um, down goes my Lodic. But, you know, now Bytopsy is, is low enough to where really anything can pick it off. I might be able to bring it in against Meowstic. But, you know, it's like the only thing. So I'm going to go to Murky Waters here. Uh, he's going to bring in tanks. So it's like literally the worst case scenario. But... Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna switch and basically sack this thing off. He goes for the uh, knockoff here. And if he go for two brave birds, I might have been able to. I, I would have been able to live the first one, and then get the cuss tap, pain split off. But he was smart. He went for knockoff, because um, that was the best play against Miss Magius. So I'm gonna go bring in Raid in here. <clears throat> basically, my not really my last resort, but something to handle this thing. And I'm gonna go for the uh, Thunderbolt here. And he's gonna bring in Colin. Um, this thing is going to want to light screen up, but I do have the knockoff, so I can take out this meow stick with the knockoff. Get rid of its light, light clay, so... He, I mean, he got the light screen up before I knocked off the light clay, so it's still going to be up for 8 turns, which is annoying as heck. But there's nothing I can do here. I need Raiden, and I need Miss Magius, not really. So, uh, I'm going to sack off City here, uh, because I need to, you know, get as much damage off on this, um... Gardevoir to hopefully sweep with Thunderous if I can, um, but yeah, I'm just gonna bring in Murky Waters here. I don't need the Sash. I know I can live one hit, so I'm just gonna go for the Hyper Voice. We live it, and we uh, get some leftovers back. If we were Life Orb, I mean, it wouldn't have mattered really. So we're gonna Shadow Ball here. Um, if we had, no, that wouldn't have mattered either. All right, never mind. Um. <laughs> My voice goes off, and, um, yeah, he's gonna take out Miss Magi- or Miss Magius. I did the calcs, I- I don't think I would've- I- I don't think I should've killed this, um, Gardevoir here, but I did get the crit, so, that's that, and if his Embor is Scarfed, then he wins. I think his Dojiro is Scarfed as well, but it might be banded, not sure. Um, so yeah, he's gonna bring in Will, and it is sure Scarfed, and it's gonna take me out. Um, I don't think- uh, with the light screen up, I don't think T T Bolt would have killed anyway. But that was a good game. That was really close. Uh, definitely, I made some misplays. I should have, I should have made. Um, no, I should have kept Latias and Skarmory. Those were my two, basically my two win cons. And then Thunderous was also there as a win con because that thing did a lot to his team. You can tell. Um, how many kills it got? We well, got two, but it could have gotten more. So. Yeah, definitely a shame. We are four and four now. That's not bad. We're at five hundred, I believe. With the two, 
I think we're still in a positive differential, I think. Hopefully we are. But, um, yeah, again, like, the crit on knockoff, like, it's a shame, but I don't think I would have been able to switch into anything either way. Um, like, after the knockoff, so, whatever. But, um, you know, getting rid of Skarmory was definitely great for him. And, uh, yeah, that, that was not good. That was not good for me. Once that thing went down, I knew that God of War was probably going to put in work. And, I mean, it got a kill. <laughs> but, um, if I still had Skarmory in the, in the last few turns, then that would have been really clutch. Uh, I'm not sure if it would have won the game for me, because he's still at Embor, but <clears throat> uh, I don't know. So that's going to be the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. We did lose, and that's a shame, but we're going to come back next week and hopefully win. I don't think... I don't know who we're up against. I should probably check. I'll just check right now, I guess, because there's no reason not to, I guess. So, um... Here, just opening it right... Well, opening it right now... We're against, okay, whoops, um, we're against Tank next week, and he has a really, really great team. Here, let's pull that up. Alright, so our differential is three, yeah, because our differential is three, and we are, oh, this is wrong, four, <laughs> I'm updating this spreadsheet real quick, sorry about that. Alright, so, that's going to be the video, I hope you guys enjoyed, if you did. Please hit the like button. That'll be, that'll be great. And uh, cause, yeah, that'll be great. Okay, I'm just gonna get out of here because I've been rambling enough already. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.